412-333-WXDX. If you want Raiders Steeler tickets, call now so we can play Are You Smarter Than? Let's welcome to the show three very attractive Caucasian women, Jess, Erica, and Lisa from Steel City Harley-Davidson. <laughs> Casino night is coming up on Saturday, November the 27th. Casino games, Vegas show, 724-225-7020. You can visit SteelCityHarley.com for more information. Uh, Lisa, why is Steel City Harley doing Casino Night on the 27th of November? We do it every year. It's for the Make-A-Wish Foundation, and it kicks off our holiday season. And it kicks ass! Yes! <laughs> can people win a Harley? No. <laughs> and they win $250. $275, right? You can win all kinds of stuff. We have a autographed uh, acoustic guitar from Miranda Lambert. We have... Harley gift baskets, beer stuff. Um, by beer stuff, you mean beer? Beer. Okay. Do you have chaps? Uh, I see a lot of Harley riders wear those chaps. We have chaps. Can you guys have worn chaps? Why are you wearing chaps today? right now? She's I know, they're dressed as Santa's <laughs> elves. Are they yeah. not the cutest Santa's elves? They are very cute. They look great dressed as Santa's elves, but I could just I like see. how the reindeer on Jess's head are looking at the cleavage on Erica. <laughs> <laughs> it's very well positioned. That's well we thought out. We it that way. Oh, now the noses are going. So <laughs> Finger 11 and Beastie Boys coming up. We're playing. Oh, they're breaking stuff in here. Are you ruining the CDs? Is it Ralph? No, no, wait. Is. Bend down and get that for us. <laughs> oh, oh, the 311 CD just bit the dust. Oh, well. Uh, <laughs> Beastie Boys coming up. Then we're going to play Are You Smarter Than? Are You Smarter Than the Girls from Steel City Harley Davidson with Casino Night there on Saturday, November the 27th. Raider Steeler tickets in the line right now. It's 1059 The X. It is 105.9 The Exit is the 9 o'clock hour on a Friday. That means it's time for Are You Smarter Than? It's our cheap rip-off knockoff of Are You Smarter Than a 5th Grader on Fox. We always bring in lovely, attractive women to have us celebrate the fact that the week is over <laughs> and to give away fun stuff like, in this case, Steeler Raider tickets for the game on Sunday. Make sure you're listening to Mark Batten's pregame show at the Rivers Casino at 11 o'clock right until kickoff. The Steel City Girls are here, Jess and Erica, and occasionally Lisa when she has something to say. <laughs> <laughs> Although she's in chaps and not a Santa's elf outfit. Which Her tongue stud keeps getting in the way. Um, here's how it works. We're going to bring on a caller. His name is Doug. Doug, where are you calling from? I'm calling from uh, near IUP, Bobby's old water. Yeah! Do you what, go like a gutter near IUP? <laughs> Over City. Okay, oh, close oh. enough. We know where that is. All right, so IUP, did you go there, Doug? No, I went to the University of Akron. Oh, okay. Well, you still don't have a shot. That's all right. <laughs> um, Doug is going to play against the Steel City Harley girls. If he wins, he gets Steeler Raider tickets. If he loses, it's open to anybody else listening right now. So stay listening, and if Doug loses, then you're in, and you can win tickets to the Steeler game on Sunday at Heinz Field. Ladies, since you came in and got all dressed up, we're going to give you the first question here. All right, first crack. Um, we were talking about Guam earlier since comedian Ralphie May is in town at the Improv. They're laughing already. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> Guam is a territory of what nation? Guam is a mm. territory of what country? Take a guess. Lisa's going to take this question. <laughs> They occasionally do ride horses. Lisa, there. is there a tattoo of Guam anywhere on your body? <laughs> yeah. No, there is not. A relief okay. map, that might be perhaps? the only tattoo that's not on your body. <laughs> if that monkey on your shoulder right there were in Guam, you would be <laughs> under the rule of what nation? Any guess? Take a guess. Try one. If you were to guess a country, what, co what country would it be? Girls. <laughs> Jess is going to take this one from here. Just throw out a country. Any country. Canada. <laughs> <laughs> the island nation of Guam, the territory of Canada. That is, that is sadly incorrect. Is like, there a Harley dealership in Guam, and can we get them on the phone right now? No, but there is one in Winnipeg. Right. Um, Winnipeg, really? Doug, do you want to... No, that, Winnipeg, <laughs> Winnipeg's a Winnipeg's city. not a country. Winnipeg's a city in Canada, not a nation. No, oh, okay, all right, okay. Doug, would you like to steal? Um... Do I have to choose, or I get a new question if I want one? No, you have to. You, you get an opportunity to choose to, oh, to answer. <laughs> if you answer, okay, you steal yeah. a point. Do you, would you like to steal a point? Yeah, I would like to steal. Okay, then where does what nation is Guam a territory of? Is it Peru? <laughs> In the most classic example yet of not seeing the forest through the trees, it's America, kids. What? This country. Yes. Oh. Look at the, the look that Erica just gave her. When did we get a 51st state? 
Yeah. It's a territory. But of we the can't States. see the look on gotcha. Doug's face. This is going to get even better now since we were such a big hit <laughs> yes. with Guam the first time around. Doug, just say Peru for every question Dude, from here on. Really Seriously, honestly, what fifth right. grader knew that? <laughs> <laughs> Anyone who lives in Guam and gets thoughts? <laughs> what nation captured Guam in December of 1941, Doug? Okay, Doug. You, you don't really need to know. Go ahead, Doug. Peru. Yeah, just say, yeah, go ahead. Say Peru. United States. No, it's not the United States. Ladies, I regret to ask this, but technically I have to. What nation occupied Guam in 1941 to 1943? What significant happened in 1941? Oh, man. Uh, uh, gotcha. Pearl Harbor, okay, right. let's let's go with that. Okay. Extrapolate a little from there. Japan. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Japan is the answer. Yay! No, not Japan. <laughs> Hold it out of her. All right. <laughs> so the ladies have a one nothing lead. Doug, you need to play catch up. What, All right. Since the, the Steelers are playing the Oakland Raiders, the Oakland Raiders near San Francisco, East Bay, West Bay, whatever Bay, San Francisco <clears throat> Bay. What color is the Golden Gate Bridge, Doug? Doug, what color is the Golden Gate Bridge? Um, I believe it's red. Uh. Close, ladies. Reddish orange. All right, I'll give you orange. <laughs> I'll give you reddish orange. That is. Autumn correct. orange, burnt orange. <laughs> you guys wanted to say gold so bad, didn't you? They were she dying to rust. say gold. She said rust. rust. Yeah, she did rust. say rust. Oh, rust. Actually, yeah. rust would have been more accurate. I think she actually gave it to him. I'm gonna you might have heard that. Reddish <laughs> orange. We'll give you that. So it's tied one one. All right, ladies. Um, if you get this question correct, you win. Okay. If okay. Doug gets the question, if you get it wrong, then he wins. All right. We were talking about... No pressure. We were talking right. about um, diamonds earlier. We were talking about the diamonds that got ah, stolen Ah, something the they know about. <laughs> they right. both just lit up. Which of the following elements is one of the few that can contaminate a diamond in its elemental structure? Okay? This is multiple choice. You feel better now, don't you? This is a little green came on her face when I said multiple choice. <laughs> I don't want to speak too soon. A, nitrogen. B, sodium. C, chlorine. Or D, iron. Which one can contaminate a diamond? Can you repeat those really quick? Sorry. Yes. Nitrogen, sodium, chlorine, or iron. Which one can contaminate a diamond? Could to go with A. Yeah, I was thinking nitrogen. A, nitrogen? That is correct. We're so smart. Ladies, <laughs> congratulations. <laughs> Those they know their Doug. diamonds. <laughs> Doug, I'm sorry. You do See not you, get the Steeler Raider tickets. Oh, man. Oh, oh we're screwed. screwed. Doug, would you like to get a, uh, the question that would have been the tiebreaker just to make yourself feel better while you're watching the game at home in your living room? Uh, yes. The tiebreaker question would have been, <clears throat> what country started the tradition of, of decorating the Christmas tree since it's light-up night in Pittsburgh? Is it, um... The correct answer is Guam. Oh, I was going to say Peru. Uh, <laughs> Doug, hang in there. I'll hook you up with some parting gifts, all right? Okay, thank you. The parting gift is a free trip to Peru. 412-333-WXDX. <laughs> the next caller in gets Steeler Raider tickets, so call now. Ladies, thanks for coming in. Thank you. Fabulous. The winner, will you ride them there on your Harley? Absolutely. All right. <laughs> call in now. It's 105.9 The X.